All right, so we're in uh, my hometown of Novato, looking down on the swamp area here. Right up against Industrial Park. That's like Biotech Marin right there. Super Biotech Marin. There's the swamp. You can see it just goes out and down. You can see in the middle there, those big trees. It's got to be drier right in there in the swamp for those trees to grow right in here. I'm sort of just doing a, a little scan without a telephoto not being able to really tell what I'm looking at through the Viewmaster here, but uh, that's okay. I saw in Kansas there's a guy who films like this with a telephoto and he gets them good right on the tree lines. Some really good shots of them in the tree lines. Now, you can see here, scanning around in the bay, that's going out towards Napa. Now that's Belmer and Keys out there. Now that's heading towards the East Bay. And right over there, somewhere in the haze, is El Sobrante on that side. As you can see, it goes quite a ways out. California weather. Let's go over there and see what we can see, huh? Let's do one more scan of this. Now down, when you're in down in there, it's a total jungle in there. And it's also a swamp. That's why, that's all willows and stuff. Then you get to a place like that right there where the trees are different and you gotta say, oh, where is that big tree? Yeah, right, like right there. That spot. It's got to be drier where that tree's growing. Or like right out here where these trees are. But you got to get through the wet to get to it. So if there's squatch hanging out, they're in there for sure. Close to the buildings. Let's scroll back and show you how close they are. See that? That's all industrial area. Industrial, industrial, all industrial, right up into the open space. That's how they do it out here in California, the big urban sprawl thing.
Oh, I think I just heard two knocks. It came from over here. Two big booms. Kung Kung. Now these hills over here where the sun is, you can't see it because the sun's in there, but that's where I had my first encounters. And going back in this valley over here, back in there, that, I don't know if you could see that. <laughs> I don't know what that looks like. No idea. It's probably not good. But, uh, yeah, right over on that hill over there, somewhere. So this swamp goes all along here. I'm walking on top of this hill. The swamp goes all the way down. And then where I was in the earlier clip was out here. Uh, right out along this line right here. Okay, so I was right in here where these trees are. This is where I was earlier today where I had that shot. It was right in here. So let's fly in. Yeah, right in those big trees right there. Right in there, that was the spot where earlier today something, some big shadowy thing was on the other side of the creek from me. And uh, the skate park's over there. And as I scroll back to the top of the hill, you can see it's part of that same system that goes along over here, all the way back around to where I just was, which is over there. Right? You can kind of see the lake over there. No, I don't think you can. Now, but anyway, it goes all the way around this hill to here. And uh, yeah, that area where that white tuft is down in there, that's the spot. Actually, those white tufts, because I could see the cars in the parking lot for the skate park. And I was right next to the skate park, so yeah, right in there. That's the spot in those trees. All right, check out the birds. Don't get hit by harp or you're all drop out of the sky. <laughs>